Australian Open 2001 produced a quarter-final between two queens of the court. Three-time champion Martina Hingis met rising superstar Serena Williams, who already had a US Open title under her belt at the age of 17. Neither player had dropped a set on the way to the last eight, and with Hingis holding a 5-4 head-to-head record, the match was bound to be a classic. The Swiss miss claimed the first set comfortably, with Williams calling for the trainer, but she returned strongly to square the match at a set apiece. We join the action in the third set with the American up a break at 3-1. 1-3, the number one seed in trouble. Double. Double fault to start. So trouble times for the three-time champion. And the uh, two for the match. Beginning to slip away from it. This one, though. She was so dominant early in this match. Remarkable change of fortune. Well, it was a great return again from Williams, deep and with a lot of pace. And she handles those overhead smashes just about the best of any woman in the game. Oh! Good day, Daisy. She's down just the one break. Again, an So a point for a double break. From Serena Williams and a lead of four games to one. Second serve, point one for Hingis, 48%. Even less than that now, that's the break. Williams has the double break. Four games to one, she leads in the third set. Williams leads. Now Williams to serve for a 5-1 lead. She's serving 57% of first serves in. chance of regaining one of those service games. Hasn't won a game since the first game of this set. Marvellous point. Point of the match, really. Yeah. Now, Serena Williams isn't feeling right. <laughs> That's ordinary now. Yeah. She can't be too bad. Now, it's in great court coverage by both players here. 15-30. That was strong. Helped get her back into the point. Hingis had to try to uh, buy some time, and she couldn't. Controlled that well. Williams ran it down. 
So a break point chance. No. Nope. The backhand working well again for Serena Williams. Cheers. Second opportunity for the top seed to retrieve one of the breaks and stop the run, perhaps more importantly, of Williams winning four on the trot. Oh, it's long and it's going on the break back. One of them at least. So a lot of tennis left in this match, perhaps, in this quarterfinal. After beginning the third set strongly, Williams was under pressure. We rejoin the action with Hingis having held serve to be within striking distance at 4-3. Oh, not a good drop shot, but an even worse reply from Hingis. Big lead off there for Serena Williams. Ring again. Oh dear, let off again. Huge miss there from Martina. The ball came right into the zone for it, and she has just hit this ball flat, straight out of court. Well, she's returned the favour there. Yeah. Break that point for Hingis. 13 40. He probably should have broken already. Sisters, they're so tall and so athletic, and uh, certainly one of the shots at the match. And what a time to bring it out, too, Chris. And some frustration from Serena Williams. In that game, both players made errors that they wouldn't normally make. As it was in the end, Hingis triumphed, and now she's got those two breaks back for all. Set, not a tie break set, we get to six all. Not this time. 
15 all. Jumped into that one. Oh, drive oh, by. Oh, drive in forehand. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>